Hello everybody, welcome back to the Binding of Isaac, the Mega Modded series. We are jumping in once again. Let's randomize our character and see who we might get today. We're going to be doing regular old Kane, that's fine by me. Uh, I actually, just before this, recently did a run with BD1P. Ooh, we start with a key as well, and we start with Bookworm off the bat, that's amazing. We get a King of Clubs, which I don't actually know what that does, so we'll, uh... We'll check that out. I think I'll probably keep the Book of Shadows. Let's just check what the King of Clubs does. Um, because I do not remember. Lose all of your bombs uh, and spawn pickups proportional to the amount of bombs lost. At least 12 bombs is needed for a trinket. At least 28 for an item. If Isaac has a golden bomb, it is instead removed to significantly increase total amount. Okay, so. Card that probably isn't going to be all that useful for now, I'd say. If we were to guess, I'd say it's probably not going to be all that useful for now. But yeah, as I was saying, just recently before this episode, um, yesterday actually for me, and probably a week or so ago for you guys, I don't actually remember. But uh, I did an episode with BD1P, and it was awesome. Guillotine. Guillotine, please. When will you leave me alone? Ooh, hello. Also perks, there you go. Yeah, guillotine. I'm sorry, but I, I just... I just can't. Okay, yeah, something wrong is this. That's an Ipecac change. Makes the something wrong pill a hell of a lot better. A hell of a lot better. Look at these dudes. They are just shredding right now. This is awesome. They're doing so well. Yeah, and it, it was an absolute blast. Super fun to play um, this game with that guy. And I'll hopefully be doing more soon. Empress Plus is... Um, let's actually check that, shall we? Oh, I didn't realize there was a golden pill there. No! Do you know what? I don't care. I'm going for it. Because we're... we're uh, Kane, baby. It's all going to be positive. Um, one minute, health and tears. Anyways, let's buy this first and just... Just spam the hell out of it. I don't care what happens. So much LSD. <laughs> I don't really know what I got out of that, but things happened. Things definitely happened. Oh my god, um, we seem to be very slow. I'm not sure why I'm so slow. What the hell hit- oh, it might have been the Phantom Pains. Okay, so this this was pretty good. The LSD's uh, really popping off right about now. Hey, this is one of my secret rooms. Hello. I did this. I'm going to take the soul of Lazarus instead. Maybe get some use out of that. The Phantom Pains is really uh, going off right now. <laughs> the LSD is great. I'm loving this. God damn. What a great start. The Golden Pill Cane is just... It's what you want to see. It is exactly what you want to see. And we're definitely going to go down here. Going to be trying to go to at least the downpour a lot more often. To try and make sure we can like destroy the mirror. To get the mirror uh, pickups, all that got sort of good stuff. And honestly, we're going to just go straight in here. Um, unfortunately, not the greatest. But yeah, um, for those of you wondering anyways, uh, regarding my secret room mods. I have been slowly updating and tweaking that. With the help of a Russian YouTuber actually called Neonomi. I'm not quite sure why this guy's so glitched. But yeah, Russian YouTuber called Neonomi. Um, he is uh, pretty well known in the community. And uh, very, very... Oh god, we just lost so much health and everything. Um, he's a very, very well-known um, Isaac player in the community. And... Um, ooh, I'm going to take this, I think. Yay, magic pen's cool. I like this. Can lead to some lag, but I like it. Wait. It ain't working. It's supposed to leave creep under you. What the heck? It ain't working. Okay, that's unfortunate. I, t I pressed that a little late there. Um, it's supposed to leave creep, but it's not leaving any creep under our tears. It's supposed to like, leave rainbow creep. Hmm, not sure who makes that, but I'll have to give them a note that that's not working as intended. But yeah, he's been uh, helping me actually balance out some of the rooms. Because as many of you know, I actually very much intended the mod to be very vanilla style. I very much wanted it to follow the same tendencies of Vanilla Isaac in terms of the room's balance. So there was a few rooms that were, were quite a bit too strong. Um, mainly ones that included like old chests or a lot of money. Uh, so those have been somewhat nerfed. Also the chances have been slightly tweaked to be a bit more reflective of what I intended. Because they were, again, they were, they were a little bit too common. They were meant to show up like once every two or three runs. And they were kind of showing up like two or three times every one run, which is... Really not what I intended for them, so he's helped me tweak that and helped me get a sort of better... Oh, we found the big poop room, and this isn't even a modded big poop room. This is the actual um, vanilla base game big poop room. Awesome. 
Sadly, we've not got a petrified poop yet, but it can drop it. This is, this might actually be one of them. Wait a minute. Don't tell me. You little dingus. That's got to be the worst large poop I've ever had. It gave me two pennies. Two pennies. Are you kidding me? That's a travesty. An absolute travesty. God damn it. I kind of wish I had that king of clubs now because we are getting a hell. A hell of a lot of bombs. Right, let's check our shop out. It's not really that worthwhile, in my opinion, but I'm going to take this anyways, because it will give us some money here and there. Um, also, we do have the ability to uh, use our Book of Shadows to play the Blood Donation Machine, so I'm going to do that now. I don't know how Invincibility uh, works with the Time Machine mod that speeds up the ability to play these. Does it run out of Invincibility quicker or not? It does, yes. It very much does. Good. Um, I'm still going to play this a little more. Just because we've got the, the piggy bank going. Do you know what? I'm going to go whole hog on this thing. We have a revive. And I'm very glad that I did. Awesome. Right. Good, good. We we have we have made some roads this episode so far. We have we have made some good stuff happen. Right. Let's go into our boss room. We don't have invincibility for the boss now. Oh, it's Colostomir as well. Haven't fought this guy in a real long time. I think that's kind of the best way to deal with him. I absolutely love Colostomir's health bar, by the way. Um, I think Colossomia has, like, one of the coolest looking health bars. Oh, god damn it. I thought he'd dive upwards. He did not. Okay, there you go. We got him into... All I wanted to do with the bombs is get him into second phase. Next phase, I didn't really care about all that much. The butt. It's the butt. Or as Northern Lion would call it, the elbow. Come on, now. Let's take you out tonight. Once he's in second phase, he's actually really not that hard at all. It's just the first phase. First phase of him is scary. Ooh, and we get glass eye for a luck upgrade and a damage upgrade. Both of which, quite necessary. We move down to the next floor. And yes, we probably will end up blowing up the mirror. Um, I don't know if we're going to do full alt path. By the way, I haven't really been checking our, our boss path in terms of where it wants us to go. I've not really been listening to that, I'll admit. Let's just keep, let's just keep on keeping on. Do you know, originally I didn't really like the sprite, re the, the fly re-sprites, but now I've left it on. I'm actually really warming to it. I think they look really good. I don't know about you guys, but having them have that sort of ca kind of blacker, darker center, I don't know, it makes them it makes them look a bit better. Okay, so this, basically this will be problematic if it spawns on the island that's just here. I don't think it will, but it very much easily could. Okay, it doesn't matter. It's gone. Um, we got our white fire in here. We probably won't be using that, I don't think. I might go to the mines. I'm still tempted to go to the mines, to be honest. I might even add the mod that makes it so that uh, Fool's Gold Rocks spawn more often in the mines. It's a mod that I kind of thought might be a little overpowered to start with, but now, the fact that I don't really have any big reason to go to the mines unless I'm going for Mother, it'd be nice to have a proper reason, so that'd be, that'd be a good interesting one to maybe add if you guys are up for that idea. So do let me know if you think that'd be a... A good one to add on board to the modded series. I think it could be quite fun. Okay. Okay. Let's let's be careful with all the heads now, shall we? And we don't have any keys right now. Okay. But we should be able to get into at least that item room or um, or shop. I think it's going to be our item room. Because I was just about to say, I think secret room is definitely there. We can at least get into here. Nord Leaf. Nord Leaf is good, but it's boring. I'm going to take Glitter Bombs. Glitter Bombs isn't the best, but yeah. Uh, I'd much rather have something a little more interesting than Nord Leaf. It can be really run winning, but I feel like unless you desperately need the completion mark, it's not really that worth going for, at least in my opinion. Yeah. Take this boy out. Grab that. Don't know where second secret room is quite yet. I'm going to check all my rooms just in case. Let's bomb our mirror. Stick around just for air. Yeah, there you go. Glitter bomb's giving us something. And now we have invincibility, so we can actually get in there with our orbitals here. Our pretty flies that do deal a little bit of damage. And our cube of meat, so we'll, we'll do exactly that. It's doing a very, very good job, actually. Invincibility is so nice. And honestly, we've got enough health here. Ooh, we lost fire rate. And damage there. We'll definitely take pentagram. And then what's this? Flyboy. Effect changes each floor. Gradually become a fly. Grants flight after the sixth floor. We'll take it. 
I don't know how useful it's going to be, but I, I suppose getting it early is going to be good. Seems to be a damage up off of the bat, which is really nice. Did need that. Seems like we got a pretty big shot speed up. Um, maybe a range down. Definitely a range down. Okay, that experimental treatment really messed us up. That that was not good at all. But I'm interested in this flyboy item. I'm wondering if it's going to be uh, easy visual vis visual progression. We got some speed there and some uh, damage again. Do you know what? Get that while we can. Nice. Keep forgetting that we have uh, piggy bank. Ooh, okay, so I, I've still been noticing and I'm still trying to sort of sort of play around with it and make sure it's not too bad. But I still have been noticing modding, uh, adding in some definite frame rate drops to otherwise non-framey things like vanilla things that wouldn't normally cause any frame rate issues and now causing some um, because of the amount of mods I have on. I've been trying to watch that as we go and make sure to disable mods that cause a lot of lag but it's kind of difficult because i don't want to disable any cool content mods at the same time god damn really need a fire right upgrade here we're going to take the all item again we're going full full on mystery and there you go we get piercing very worthwhile the speed upgrade obviously doesn't matter do you know what i'm gonna pop invincibility on this room this room's kind of tough let's crack open this danger room's great we'll take the health as well danger room essentially when projectiles get near us but don't hit us, we uh, we can gain consumables. You'll see a little bar pop up, a little purple bar as you see it there. It's really good for bullet health style bosses, can give you extra HP, can give you extra money, all that sort of good stuff. Try and blow up this mushroom here. LSD. Oh, I was like, oh, we'll take the pill, it's positive. And then before, before I realized, uh, it's LSD. Okay, stop getting hit by the little coal. This is a hard room. I do like this interjection from Rooms Galore of some of these more difficult rooms though. I don't know if this one specifically is from Rooms Galore, but I'm just saying in general, having having an interjection of, of extra difficult rooms is really nice. Again, we'll uh, utilize our invincibility there. Again, I think I think this is one of the items um, that I underutilize a lot uh, in terms of having an active that's three room charge and never really using it. I very rarely use the Book of Secrets, uh, sorry, Book of Shadows, and I really need to more often, so I'm going to try and brain train myself into actually using it, um, especially when there's double rooms like this that give us extra charges. I do love LSD as a pill, it's so funny. I don't know how long, long it lasts, so I don't know if it's room-based or time-based. Okay, so this is an annoying room, but we can uh, do this. Ah, oh, that didn't work, okay, doesn't matter. Ah, oh, that was perfect, that was perfect. Lined that up nicely. Right, um, we've already been to our shop and item room. I guess we're just looking for secret rooms at this point. This this below us could easily be one. God damn, our fire ray is pathetic. That's a good trinket, and I think it's going to be worth it over that. More LSD. Um, <laughs> Bumbo is now Jeremy Hillary's Hillary boob. Bob's brain is a yellow submarine. Interesting. Range up. We actually did need that quite badly, so that's nice to get. Um, now nah, let's so let's let's uh, let's go do our boss. Yeah, I wonder why magical pen isn't working. It's kind of strange. Maybe that mod needs an update. There's actually a weird bug that's been going on on the workshop over the past like month or two. That's never I've never had an issue with before. But there's just an issue with it just never updating mods. Like you have to fully uninstall the mod, then reinstall it for it to actually update. And it's a really frustrating issue because obviously a lot of the time you don't know when a Steam Workshop item has been updated. So there's broken things from updates and things that uh, nerfs and stuff that I might not be getting and not even know about. So I'm going to make it sort of a, a, a general thing to try and... Um, also, this is a really smart way of there of having these dudes spawn right on top of the fire. Um, I'm going to try and make it a general mission of my, of my own to make sure that I uh, uninstall and reinstall all my mods at least once every few weeks. Just to make sure everything is actually up to date. Because, yeah, things just aren't updating as they should be. Okay, well, we're taking some damage here. We've got enough health to make it work, though, so I don't really mind. Oh, god damn. Oh, god damn. Good, good. Some more dumpies. I like the fact that there's dumpy waves for this now as well, especially considering there's some fire dumpies that can spawn now too. There's some meat rollers too. Okay, last wave. Slightly harder one. I'm trying to activate danger room when I can, but I don't want to force it, if you know what I mean. 
Nice. Ah, oh, pageant boy. We've got so much money. At least it gave us a nickel, but we've got so much money. And it gives us some keys, I suppose. Okay, so, interesting enough, we now have the reflected reflected items. Uh, this was actually a suggestion by my by, by me of adding a, a new visual effect to um, the reflected items. I will say, I am... I know that this is a, a shame, considering it's just been added, but I am quickly going to disable it, just because it seems very laggy right now. Um, I'm not quite sure what that's about. But yeah, this would give us two of these. Unfortunately, this isn't active, so it's really not worth taking double of them at all, uh, which is a real shame. Um, I am going to take it, however, anyways. Because I do want this item. Okay. Let's go down to the next floor. Yeah, I do I do really like this item. So and by the way, in case of any of you are wondering, I've now have I now have a full save file for both jo uh, Job and for uh, Mastema. So both of those modded characters, I've got all the items unlocked for them now. Just so we can play around with them all. I want to be able to show everything off pretty much. Okay, we just got to be careful with our health now because we don't really have invincibility anymore. Okay, good. Well, we've been gaining health pretty okay, uh, pretty okay amount. God damn, I need to be way more careful. Holy hell, I... Wait, what? Why am I taking full heart damage from this boy? Do they always do full heart damage? Am I going insane? I might die here. I do have a revive, so that's not as bad. Not as big of an issue, but I'd rather not. This is a very, very horrible room. <laughs> Please stay away from me. Good. Please stay away from me. You don't want to die near you or, or attack near you, because you, you're going to get hit if, if that happens. Oh, what? No! It spawned on me. You can't do that, game. It spawned on me. I would very much like this range upgrade. Also a secret room. Nice. I'm a little bit worried, I, I got to admit. Push that bomb over there. Item, this could be good. This could be good. Should also... I gambled. I gambled. <laughs> we got concussion. That's a two-heart deal for concussion. I had, to, I had to find out what it was. Oh, we're so dead. Okay, concussion seems amazing, and it's a pocket item, so... Maybe we'll be okay here. Oh, God. Oh, God. There's a Stony in here, too. Okay, the Stony died for some reason. Please be an active. Nope, it's Burger Bombs. I was going to say I can re-roll re it a few times. Strength card. Need our revive on us. Although, if you don't have it in your active slot when you die, it doesn't do anything. So this might actually not be that good. We're going to have to keep swapping it with Concussion. And I guarantee we're going to accidentally use it one time. It's going to be horrible. The Concussion seems amazing, considering how quick it reloads as well. Come on now, boy. Oh my god, you see that near miss there. This is scary as all hell. Why haven't I been to my item room also? It's like just over there. Okay, that was good. That was good. We killed almost all of these dudes. Kill this dude first. I wonder if it knocks shots back. I have no idea if that's the case. But I just... I'm desperately in need of a fire rate upgrade and some HP right now. Okay, let's go to our item room because apparently I decided to just not go in it earlier. Oh my god, I'm, this is scary. Also, this is definitely secret room. Oh, wait, it's not? Okay. 
I am big wrong. We don't know either item this time. Dry baby. Not really the hero we needed. He's probably not going to solve all our problems. <sighs> I'm just going to go check something real quick. Just be careful of these spikes. No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I was going to check the secret room. But we've already found secret room. I'm stupid. Oh my lord. Why did I make this silly, silly play? I had to do it for the for the risk. Oh no, this is this is a room we're getting hit in. Bigly. This is too much, man. I can't I can't cope. Okay, that's our death. Why is there so many of them? Dude, calm down. Holy hell. Holy hell. Calm down. We're definitely going to die here. If we do, that's just par for the course. We'll just keep, we'll keep on keeping on. But uh, let's go get our strength card as well for the boss. Gimme, give gimme. Give I need it. Concussion's definitely going to help, but we need a soul heart like right now. One champion right now could easily kill us. I don't even know how these enemies work. Like these dumpies. I don't know how they damage me. Is it just pushing me into spikes or do they poison me too? Because it looks like they could poison me too. I want to get over here, but the spikes are just horrible looking. Okay, good. Extra bombs. Strength card, just in case. Gotta remember, we also have Blood Earth on this run too, which leads to some interesting uh, horribleness. Oh no. I hate the fact that these dudes spawn those spiders. Thank you, Dry Baby, for killing that dude for me. Okay. My god. Torn photo. We got fire rate back. Oh my lord. We can't. We can't do it. It cannot be done. Right. Oh my god. Down we go. Feeling. Whew. Oh boy. Oh yeah. I forgot about blood rights. That's definitely going to get us killed. If we die, that's how. Blood rights. Is it Blood Rites it's called? Blood Rites Y. Can I open? No, I can't. I'll see if con Concussion could maybe open things from a distance. I love the knockback that it gives as well. That's kind of like one of the biggest saving graces about this setup. Still, wait. Did our fire rate go down again? Wasn't it like 2.6 something last floor? Wait. As we're turning into a fly, are our tears getting lower and lower? What's going on? Why is my tears so low? Hold up. Wait a minute. Oh, God. Okay. Just keep our distance. Yeah, our tears are just going down and down. Wait, what? That hit me? How did that hit me? I think I blasted him into myself. We don't have any health remaining. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Also, boss room. Please give us HP. Cracker Jacks. My knight in shining armor. Thank you. Okay. We still have incredibly low damage. That was a really terribly placed bomb right there. And that one too. Oh my god. I have 13 of them, so I'm going to keep using them. But like, I just get better at... What? How did that hit me? Oh my god, I'm so terrible at this game. This is only one of two bosses. Thank you, Dry Baby. When he's concussed, I don't know where he's going to jump. I need to be careful about that. Oh my god. Smacking them when all the flies are about, not a good idea. Oh, this is... This is some sauce!
This is some sore horse. Please don't. Just leave me be. I'm a simple man. Dry baby, why now? Cage? Are you kidding me? I don't have time for this. I don't have the skills for this. I don't have the energy for this. Like, I've, I've got to get in there with concussion, I think. This is just painful. Oh, damn. He can kill his own babies. I did not know that. That doesn't kill you now? Wait, why is Concussion doing so low damage? Concussion was like killing big enemies in like one hit on the mines. Now it's like, nah. Oh, I got hit. Fuck, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. <laughs> this run is a tragedy. This run is a tragedy. Stop throwing your shitting children at me. This ain't no daycare, bitch. How did this all go so wrong? Oh my god. How the flippity flip did we get out of that? We ain't living, are we? We ain't living. Fucking hell. I gotta, I gotta try for this. I, honestly, I have never seen one of those skulls drop a half heart in my entire life. I don't know why that happened, but I'm so glad it did. Why is there a golden chest? Oh, no, it was over the gap, wasn't it? Okay. We don't have flight yet. Okay, so this is a room I think we just focus and we, we don't bother using the uh, thingies on. The concussion too much. We just focus on getting kills. Wait, why are we getting red hearts from blowing up rocks? What's going on? <laughs> That wasn't a thing. What, what item could possibly be doing that? Danger room, maybe? I've never seen it do, do that before. God, diggity damn, we pulled it back. We pulled it back. I don't know how, but we pulled it back somewhat. It, we still need serious fire rate upgrades, though. Our fire rate is atrocious. I think if we hit enemies into a wall, that's where the big damage comes. Okay. That's where we're seeing the insta-kills. We've got to hit an enemy into a wall. So if we're hitting a boss, it doesn't really do much. It just concusses them, as, as you can see there. I did good damage, but these enemies are really weak, so it doesn't really count. Or maybe not, because that didn't kill us. Oh, actually, it's left them very, very weak, though, I suppose. So. Oh, these guys can't be knocked back, that's why. They didn't actually get knocked into the wall. Oh, fruitcake. Hell yes. Oh, maybe it was the glitter bomb that left the red heart. Maybe it was the glitter bomb that left the red heart. That makes way more sense, actually. Oh, for fuck's sake. Lost that soul heart. I really want to get over there, but there isn't really a way to... Are you... Stop placing that room anywhere. That room needs to be deleted forever. In fact, I'm going to make a mod that just does that. It literally just removes that one room and that's it. <laughs> Golden Apple fully restores HP. We don't really need that right now. Okay. Let's keep it going. I hope we don't have to go that way. Get out of here. That's pretty funny. We do have to go that way, unfortunately, so that's going to be fun. Luckily, we do have two speeds, so we shouldn't be too, too bad off. Just... Oh, wait. We've got Curse of the Maze. It's gone. Oh, wait. We got three cards? What the hell? Uh, and that was a trapped chest. Okay, so one of them here is Justice. Good stuff. We've got Magician, and we've got the Moon. We're going to pop the Moon now. Okay, so, the way this works is we can keep the two soul hearts, or we can do this. We can go like this, drop that bad boy in there, and then go boom, boom. And we now have that little clot boy 
actually fucking smelted. That's so good. Okay, great secret room. Very strong secret room, I will say. Giving you the two free soul hearts is incredibly powerful. So I hope that that's very rare. Um, but otherwise, pretty cool. Uh, and then we have the magician card for the boss fight itself. Little buddy, can you like get on top of me so we can do stuff together? I wonder if Fruitcake affects my uh, concussion sweep. I I'm going to assume it does. Yeah, homing for this room is going to be super useful. Oh, I got hit there, really? I mean, I know that I got hit there, but like, I really shouldn't have been hit there. I that was my own fault. I should have been more cautious. I really should have paid more attention to what was going on in my surroundings. Okay, we were doing Blue Baby. Okay, take the Polaroid. We've got the Quasar Shard, damages all enemies, turns uh, every item pedestal into three Lemmigitten Wisps. Intriguing. I'm gonna pop this and then run. <laughs> By the way, this is such a cool, um, such a cool card. It just places just a fuck ton of bombs of all varieties, including Giga Bombs. Run. <laughs> but like, if you have the better bombs mod that adds a bunch of different visual synergies, it looks awesome. It just looks so good. My lordy lord. My lordy lord, lordy lord. Let's, uh... Oh, fuck! I forgot about this! No! No, 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 no! A health! She is gone. We're gonna have to, um... We're gonna have to gamble on the, uh... The old... The old bombs to try and get some hearts here. Fuck me! Ah! This is the worst room. Thank you, Dry Baby. You absolute amazing bastard. Okay, I'm actually just gonna play some bombs now to try and get at least a heart. Glitter bombs, could you like give me some stuff, please? I can see forever. We got a secret room. We got a secret room. Oh, you bitch! I didn't ask for this. Oh, I should have. I should have definitely quasared that. Oh my god! This is evil. Stop! <laughs> it won't give me anything. I know that fruitcake's gonna end up killing me. Come on, game. Just please give me something. Oh my god, a soul heart. <laughs> oh, joyous day of days, a soul heart. Holy flibbity flip fluck. I'm a scurred boy right now. I am a big scared boy. Oh, the triple. We gotta go for it. Yes, that's all I needed. Also, what the fuck is this room? Laser ghosts and things on the wall. We took a hit. We, we lost the soul heart that we gained from coming in here. This is such a fucking effort. Also, I love the visuals for this fly item. I really should have kept the two soul hearts rather than smelting, right? <laughs> That's the apparent thing right now. Okay, these are all regular waves. I forget, I forget this wasn't a boss wave. These are just regular waves on this floor now. Two pins. We shouldn't have too much trouble with these guys, but... I've said that before and regretted it, so... There we go. We're good. We're good. LSD. Thank you. Thank you. Do not walk into the reflected. Oh my god, a heart. Oh, the fallen too.
And very good damage against said Fallen. Especially when we're charming him like that. Nice. The Corrupted Heart. Higher chance finding Black Hearts. Picking up a Black Heart spawns. Oh, hell yes. That is needed. It didn't give a Black Heart on pickup, but that's still needed. Honestly, I'm going for it. We need the damage. This is risky as shit. But we gotta do it. We gots to do it. My lord. Gots to do it. Right, Bales. We actually got Beelzebub at the end. We got 42 keys. After six floors, we got Beelzebub. Nice. So now we have flight and friendly flies. Yeah, I don't know why the description says gain flight after six floors rather than gain Beelzebub after six floors. That would make way more sense. I think more people would understand. Okay, let's be careful because these enemies are notoriously annoying. Because they brimstone. Okay, so I do wonder how the black hearts more often is going to play out. Like, how much more often? Is it mitre levels of more often or is it even better than that? Trinket. Oh, no, that was not a hit I should have taken at all. Algis. Algis could be useful. If things get dire, we'll take the algis. Rather not, though. Secret room, maybe? Secret room, maybe? No, no, no. It's these babies. Go away. One of them just teleported onto me. Thank God he didn't actually touch me. Otherwise, I would be big mad, big sad. Got the piercing on these guys. So good. Right. Taken care of. Extra bombs is nice in case we get into another dire situation. Why not these dying? Thank you. Oh my god, they got knocked so far. Wait, one of them's a boss? Which one's a boss? Ah, you fucker! Where's my black hearts, bitch? I was told I'd receive more black hearts. This information was falsified. I feel completely betrayed. Fuck me, what do I even do here? I think I think we have to go back. Get the algaes and do this room with the algaes. That's the only way I can see us, like, realistically being able to do this. Especially considering the lasers at the very start. We've got to pop it the moment we enter. The eyes at the start are really the biggest killer for me. Also, danger room here should be great. Extra range up. Hopefully we can get some black hearts out of this, but I don't know how range danger room's uh, spawns actually were. Okay, let's we'll see if we can get any health from in here. Destroy all these real quick. Taking damage spawns a random charmed demon enemy has a small chance of instead spawning a demon boss. Charmed enemies persist between rooms. Bosses do not. Okay. Unfortunately, cannot take that. Hurrah. Okay. Go back for our soul of Isaac real quick. This has been a struggle. Oh my god, the bus. The struggle bus is real. Holy hell. I'm going to try and look for second secret room while we're at it. There's a few places I think it could be. There you go. What on earth is this room? That's a bit evil. Just a heart. But I suppose there needs to be good with the bad. There also needs to be some bad second secret rooms. Oh my god. We do have Pair of Polar Invincibility, but some of the custom enemies within the cathedral and the chest are pretty fucking brutal, so... Two 
Two reflecteds. No thank you. Decidedly not my jam. Okay, thank you, Dry Baby, for doing that for me. Not having any more red hearts left is definitely problematic, you motherfucker. We're so dead. Okay, this this room could save us. Don't accidentally walk into the reflected penny. An eternal heart? Not what I was expecting, but holy hell is that good. Come on, just keys? I got 55 keys, fuck you. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Why did my brain think that was a good place to stand? Mask, go away. Do not come again another day. Fucking cursed eye. Okay, Soul of Isaac. Forget me now? Oh my god. I really don't see how Forget Me Now can help that much, but I'll take it. Why not? Oh my god. I'm just trying to make the most desperate of plays right now. Damn it. I don't know what these dumpies do. This is why dumpies were removed. I love dumpies, but my god, they move like absolute fucking caffeine addicts. Where are my extra black hearts? Fuck me. It just lied to me. Are you fucking... Did you see? Did you see the... that I fucking killed him! Ah! Ooh. <laughs> Fucker are you, Isaac? Fucker are you! Oh my god, that was so frustrating. No, no run again. Who are you? Hi, you bastard. Anyways. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that run nonetheless. That was a fun modded run, and I will see you guys in the next one.